what Lady them are doing in L.A. with the brown bag. Oh, oh, brown bag. Brown bag is the best in here, brown podcast. bag pie. Episode 72, 72. 72. And before you guys keep watching, Thanksgiving. Facts. And before you guys keep watching, press the link and go buy some tickets. Tickets, tickets, buy some tickets for the Brown Bag Live Show. Okay, this is really cool. It is November. Uh, November 14. 14. 14. Yeah. And we just locked in something super special, crazy, amazing, and you will only get to experience it when you're at the live show. So shout out to everybody yes. that already got their tickets. You just got an extra added on top of seeing And don't us be guessing what it is in the comments, all right? As brown bag, Just yeah. know we're going to be doing something, but somebody else is going to be doing something as well. <laughs> it's going to be... You know the vibes? You know the vibes. Yeah. Vic, you better... Yeah, bro, people aren't dumb. Our fans are actually oh, pretty smart. Vic. Can you Can dolphin you Vic, please? Though, for, yeah. Yeah. Just dolphin the, the that part. Can't allude to shit these days. All right. Yeah, but I ain't gonna lie. I'm excited for the live show. <laughs> Knowing Vic, we never really talked about how Vic um, posted the background wall before we did the reveal. Remember when we painted this? Vic just wanted to post for his gram, his outfit. My outfit was hard. Yes, in my you defense. couldn't wait, dog. What we am I supposed to do? Black reveal. out the wall? No, not post. <laughs> Literally, not post. I couldn't wait. Fit I know that, and that's why we shouldn't tell Vic the secrets I know, I know. of the we, live like, show. Like we gotta have like a separate group chat, yeah, with his own manager, yeah, and just <laughs> no one tell Vic for his own good. Oh my god, <laughs> that'll be fucked up. We just have a separate group chat where we plan a guy that shit, yeah. So you're not a ruin. I'm it. not the bean spiller. Right? You're def- no, you definitely are. You're like a caption spiller. Yeah, like, you'll do you some do shit, it for like, the gram. Like for let's mm, say like no, for let's say we're to have Drake performing at the live show, right? Mm-hmm. You would be like. Yeah, champagne probably coming in yeah. December. I don't know when mm-hmm. though. Like, <laughs> like, like, or you would like, tweet. Like, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, I feel you. Or you, you would that tweet does sound something. like me. <laughs> you would tweet it. He's giving away so much shit in his in his uh, fucking Twitter. If you guys been paying attention to my story, I've subliminally been like promoting what we're doing, but it's it's not really subliminal. Like I just personally Talk like you, guys. you know what I mean? Which one of your friends can keep a secret? Me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm fucking horrible, dog. Like, like, it's like, it's like, especially like, okay, so like, you know how like there's there's always the person that's kind of like the glue in the friend group. Yeah. That's me. That's me. Like I'm. Everybody comes to me with their problems, and I somehow gotta figure out the way to solve it, and everybody be okay with each other. Yeah. But also, I do like the most things, like the live show. Like mm-hmm. I'm always having parties and kickbacks, so I will use them like damn, you're not in the kung fu. All right, be like that, but be like that fool. Nah, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. And then I make him feel like shit. He's like, so don't want to Google, this person's gonna be there. I'm like, so that's what matters, fool? Not even my success? <laughs> and they'll be like, oh, no, shit, no, no, no. You know what I mean? So, like, certain shit like that, but secret is, is kind of like hard. Like, I gotta tell somebody. <laughs> like, I can't keep it to myself. Who do you even, tell? Um, who do I usually tell secrets to? My mom. And then uh, she. I tell my mom no, no, sure. no, no. If it's like something like serious, my mom knows to keep it herself, but if it's just like a cheese man, like yeah. something funny, like let's say like the homie shit himself, he doesn't want nobody to know. Oh, he's gonna hear it, but I'm gonna keep it a secret for as as much as I can. Yeah. <laughs> but like, yeah, certain shit. Like I found out something about Jakarta in Oakland, uh-huh. and I couldn't hold it in, dog. I told all the homies. <laughs> <laughs> and then when I told the homies, he's like, "We already knew that for Jakarta said he was gonna tell us because he knew you were gonna tell us, and we're wow. on that from But we all found out something, you feel me? Like so, it's just like that. Yeah. But like. Example, like, what happened with Kali mm-hmm. and this girl. Like, it was just a funny tease, man. Like, so to everybody. Oh, I knew about right. that shit as it was going on play-by-play. Play. It yeah, was in a whole different city. Like, Yeah, we started a group chat with Kali. With without Kali. It, it was a group chat without Kali and just me and, like, look what your friend is doing. Like, Wow. <laughs> and, then, and then we're like, look, he's driving 100 mile power with a sprinter. And then Vic calls him and goes down to 72. I'm like, oh, you need a Vic to call you to calm you down. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> Well, yeah, Cali can't keep a secret either on, the, on that side. Oh, he's trash. He told oh, me he's the worst. He's the like, hey, so and so told me not to tell you, but I'm gonna tell you anyway because I don't give a fuck. Yeah. All right, and then I'm thinking like, I'm like, when I tell him shit, <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be the same way. <laughs> nah, let the, you're pretty good at keeping secrets. Yeah, I'm a good yeah secret you're, you're a good secret keeper for sure. Yeah, I just tell the boys and they can't tell you. <laughs> yeah, nah, I know like, Jorito, Luis, maybe. They Jorito, know some shit. Jorito probably has like a whole like seminar around his preschool. Like, yeah, yeah. Like, hey, guess you guys. What? He just, so, he just so do you know who's coming out on the Brown Bag Podcast? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to tell you. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, no, nah, no, nah, but Letty is really good. I can be yeah. yeah, you are. So, look, I'm, I'm going to get started a little bit real quick. Aww. But, like, so, like, we've been looking for my dad. We haven't heard from him from, like, two months. So, we think um he passed away. So, we've been, my sisters and them been looking for him. Went yeah. to TJ. So, I was supposed to go, but I was filming. 
So I've been kind of like out the way and shit. We've been trying to like figure out like calling Morgan and hospitals and shit like that. And I told Letty and she was like, I'm not trying to make it sad, but I was like, nah, yeah, if it's good though, it's good. She's like, fuck, I'm gonna go cry after we click. Yeah, because I'm the emotional one. So everything, and, and the thing about Duno is he's stepping up. He's stepping up, he's very young, but these are things that he should not be worried about. But he's, you know, he's, him and his sister Cookie are really the only ones that can go to Mexico and do this stuff. Yeah. And it's just unfortunate, unfortunate situation all around. But I just see Duno stepping up. But that's why, to me, I'm very, like, aware of what's going on. So I'm, like, constantly checking on him. And he's constantly fucking. I'm like, fool, I'm be good. Like, I'm filming, I'm filming. But it's like, no, you're mm. not good, bro. Like, talk to me. Like, nah, it's good, it's is good, everything good. okay? Have you nah. checked in? It's Just... okay. It's okay to like slow down and but like do you know how feeling? crazy it sounds that, hey, yeah. I think my dad is dead. I am yeah. contacting Morgs and TJ. Yeah. And I can't. Which is very frustrating. TJ is yeah. horrible. Okay, no, but besides even the business part of it, do you know that's. In, that's yeah. huge. It's okay to it's okay to like. Oh no, most definitely. I, I get what you're saying though, especially like in our like, like field. line of work. But do you see can... how none of them knew because I don't fucking. Feel no, I'm saying yeah. you're gonna keep we, secret. We, right? we can't. We can fill up our schedule. Oh, Kylie knew a little bit as much as we want. We can fill up our schedule to be as busy as, as we want. Yeah. Usually, so I, I think like that's good that you're being productive. But it's okay to like feel what you're feeling. Oh no, too, most you know definitely, like, and and because it's hard and it's gonna hit you one day out of nowhere. Yeah. You're gonna be driving or something and. Yeah. You know, like, yeah. And that's normal. And that's <laughs> nah, normal. Like, no, nah, look. Like, it's funny because, look, at the end of the it's day. It's not funny. No, nah, it's not know, funny. It's, it's not literally funny. not funny. It's not funny because, like, I know, like, how frustrated it could be for, like, my older sister and them because they were, like, closer. But it's also yeah. frustrating with their status of, like, yeah, them not being born here. It's kind of yeah. like everything lands kind of on me and my sister. Shout out my sister Cookie, which yeah. she's been, like, and, she, you know, she works a nine-to-five job. So she's busy constantly, you know? But she's been calling. And we contact these people like through my, WhatsApp. Through like what's up and Facebook. What's up? Through like, what's, what's up? What's up? What's up? <laughs> but like you can't like, you know, over here you could just call and be yeah. like, this is what he looks like. Like over there, nah, you gotta go like personally walk around and shit. So shout out my sister Cookie. She's been holding it down for the family. Yeah. I've been busy filming, but yeah, we just gotta you feel And me? I've just been praying that it's not the worst case scenario that maybe he's just on a trip somewhere. Like yeah. Hella smoked out. Yeah, and and hope best case scenario, which is crazy. <laughs> but also, it, but it is kind of sad because of the weather and shit. You know what I mean? Like it's extra. It's sad because that's your dad. No, dog. but I'm talking about like certain factors. Uh, no, yeah. Stop making that face, Mike. When you look sad. It's bro. not because it's this fool no, talks not. like yeah. nothing. No, I think it's because fool like that's okay, life. Okay, let me tell you. I'm, I know it is life. It it's is life. life, bro. It's life, but it's not life you should be dealing with right now. And I know you've dealt with a lot of shit in life, so this feels very numb. But or just very regular, but it's not like Duno's talking to me so about. We're preparing for a life show. Sending food. photos to the morgue to possibly identify bodies that they have in there that are haven't gone identified. That's insane. That's big. That's and then he's like, yeah, I'm gonna go film with fucking AD right now. I was like, bro, you need to like at least put it on me. Like like if if you're gonna talk to anybody about it, talk to me about it. I know you talk to Cookie clearly. Like, oh yeah, with my family we have a group chat booming. But but yeah, we love you, Duno. Yeah, it's good, man. It's good. We living. We got a live show. We're preparing for it. Can I hold your hand just for a little bit so you can yeah. feel my love? I always tell Jorito when I hug him, can you feel my love? He's like, yes, I feel love. And then, and, and what's crazy is that my mom, you know, they're not together. We put my mom through a lot of my mom's still like, every day she just like, it's 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 not it's funny. Not it's funny. not funny. It's not funny. It's not funny. But like, we'll just randomly be sitting there. She'll be like, are you okay, right? I'm like, fool, I'm playing Call of Duty. Shut up. <laughs> Not that I don't tell her to shut up, but I'd be like mid kill streak. Like, I'm about to get a UAV and shit. And she know, wants to ask me about my Dude, dad. Dude, like, die, fucker, die. She's like, Mijo, are you okay? Yeah. <laughs> Everything's good. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing's wrong. <laughs> I'm like doing call out. Yeah. And she like, wants to pray. I'm like, fool, I don't want to pray right now. He's good. Like, he's good, he's good. You know, oh you got to think God. positive. You got to think positive. Duno's yeah. taking that on the fucking, on the other yeah. <laughs> gamers the and shit. On the 12-year-old He's taking that out on the gamers. Talking about Modern Warfare 2, you know how many times I've been called all types of, like, Latino remarks, like, racist <laughs> remarks? Oh, like, you know, Call of Duty is back. Like, Modern Warfare 2, like, they called I me a wet back. And I was like, why'd you call me that? He's like, you sound like one. Oh, oh shit. Like, bro, the, those lobbies are crazy, y'all, Josh. Uh, Josh and them, no, those lobbies that's are... That's not my life. I don't know anything that you guys are talking bro, about. Bro, huh? Those lobbies are yeah, like... It's like Instagram sure. comments, but people actually <laughs> saying it. Oh, yeah. yeah. But it'll be... You know, like, that, that kid that went viral? That's like, I want to kill my mom. It's like... It's like... Tens of thousands of those those? kids. Uh, Bro, they'll be like, they'll be like, yeah. Just so we see, I'm taking the shot. Yes, yes. For Duno? For Duno. I'll I'll believe it when I see it. Cheers, cheers. I love you She's going to distract us. Hold on. 
Watch her. I love you a lot. Ooh, shut up. Ooh, right, get a mark, marker and mark the part of the bottle. Why are you fucking assholes? I'm trying to. It's Dad? Thanksgiving. I want to be emotional. Yes, I'm in Yeah, yeah. yeah. The, the trip. I told her to take the shot. <laughs> Nah, fuck what the, what the <laughs> fuck was that? Bullshit. That was a uh, <laughs> distraction tactic. Sleight of hand. Nah, now fuck you're making, you putting extra on it with the fuck faces. You. Yeah, the homies be like, you be kissing the bottle, fool. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> like, like, so like, I mean, I don't want, I uh, fuck it. Do we, it. We sure don't deep throat it. Yeah. No, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> but like, oh my God, have you learned about the thumb trick? <laughs> what thumb oh trick? Oh my God, go, 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 go. Okay, so go. like, so like, you know, usually. <laughs> Hold on, wait. Ooh, ooh, no, I'll share it, I'll share it. I'm about to. Up your guys' sex lives. Oh. Yeah, go, go, go. go, go. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. I'm, I'm kicking up with somebody tonight. No, Ooh. But usually, like, you know, food waterfall, right? Uh. But I'll be like, I'll be like. Oh, so they're like, you're kissing. They're like, they'll be like, oh, you kissed the bottle, fool. You didn't even really drink that. And it's, that's facts. Oh, I get you. Okay, so the thumb trick. Um, apparently, okay, you know how we all have a gag reflex, right? And what happens during your gag reflex is something gets lodged in your throat, clearly, and your your human response is to, like, get rid of it, <coughs> cough it out, or try to get it out, right? Um, apparently, if you do this with your thumb, and you just hold your thumb with your other fingers, kind of like you're doing a thumbs up, but, like, inward, right? That for some reason, your brain doesn't focus on what's going on in your throat, and it focuses on the thumb, so then it removes the gag reflex. So uh, the theory is... That if you're a girl giving head and you have a gag reflex, you do the thumb trick and it can go further. There you go. You're welcome. Was that 10 minutes in at least? <laughs> just. What am I supposed to do with this piece of information? I don't know. Just share it. Be like, share hold on, girl. Go like this. Share it with a friend. <laughs> just see how far it'll go. <laughs> Test it out. Experiment. For, Science. For, for, before you put the glizzy in your mouth, just do this. You could actually try it. Like, literally try it without. I don't, 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 don't want to try <laughs> the, the tactic. <laughs> <laughs> you bitch, like you could tell her, hey, don't like if you hey, have your girl, girl. Right? I feel, I feel like suck the chora without this and then and then tie with it. Let's, let's figure it out. <laughs> I've never heard chora. You never heard the chora? No, the chora. Oh, I heard chon chon. You never heard oh, the chora no, for real? No. no. I would be like, you're the fucking chora. That sounds like chora. Like chora, you're the chora nation. The Torah Meister. <laughs> All right, another shot. Shout out to the thumb trick. Hey, if, if this oh helps you in any way, you're welcome. Please leave the comment if you tried this. Yeah. Stop the pot and go give some. <laughs> Let's stop the suck... pot. Buy Pot-head. tickets and go hey, hey, suck hey, hey. the thumb trick. Is this, like, is this going to be like a new signal for like sucking dick? <laughs> <laughs> like... We just do it. Go on your thumb trick. Oh, like, the live show, it forever? Girl, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> for the live show, for the live show, girls just... Then he's just gonna go like this, and all the girls are gonna fall. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm actually gonna bag, do that. Put your fists up. <laughs> and then, 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 and <laughs> oh, I love this for us. Happy oh Thanksgiving. Okay, let's take another shot for. And then let's talk about Wakanda forever. No. <laughs> you guys, on, these, these two pieces of shits over here. No, this one piece of shit didn't watch it. So because didn't he didn't do watch his homework, it, yeah. he didn't. He doesn't want to talk about it on the podcast. First of all, you guys, it's because look, you guys have a priority to do shit like all the time. Like no. the kids want to want to go see Wakanda, right? Yeah. But uh, Loki, I had to leave uh, midway because Luisito was over it. He was wilding. Yeah. It's like five hours long. I had to leave in the fourth the movie, hour. How, how long is this movie? Two, like two I hours, got there like 30 minutes, minutes late. I'm going to be honest. Yeah. Well, so you didn't see the first 30 minutes? Nah. You're fine if you didn't. You're good. Yeah, I heard it was just like sad shit anyway. Like the end is the shit that you wanted yeah. to see. Okay, well, yeah. Let's not talk about it. Yeah, what kind of though? No, can we talk about like the At themes least the in actor. it? The, okay, yeah. Namor. Namor. Brown Pride. That shit. Yeah, okay, yeah. Super Brown Pride. Brown Pride. Brown Pride. Um, <laughs> I suppose like we're doing my job. Super Brown Pride. So, <laughs> what, like up to my surprise... The movie was basically there was no male protagonist besides uh um, That means Namor. good guy. Yeah. Good guy, but he was um, the antagonist. Actually, he's supposed to be the bad anti- guy. Yeah. Um and he's not a villain, you guys. Oh my god, bro. Yeah. <laughs> but there okay, so oh it was all god. about women. It was all about women. Ah! It is not all about women. Okay. okay How is it not all ahead, about go women? Ahead, go ahead, get out of your system. Get out of your system. I right actually now. think it's actually about Namor. Uh, and his like his life. No, I'm just saying on. it was. I'm not criticizing it because it was actually dope. Because the the characters are fire. Yeah. Like and they were strong. They were. 
can't hear Dunos is from the movie. What, but what was interesting, I'll, I'll wrap Dun- it up. We can't do it. We can't. Dunos being uh, a child. A you are 10 kid. years old, Dunos. <laughs> We're not giving away you the plot or like the ending or anything. Shut the fuck up, Dunos. Oh, Shut fuck. the fuck up. <laughs> you're not even going to watch it. <laughs> Okay, we You're are gonna watch okay. it on Disney Plus in like a month. Come on. Brown bag as a family. We are holding off one week to talk about Wakanda Forever. But you better watch it and you better watch it. Watch Come it next week. If you haven't watched it, I don't care. We're talking about it. I'm pretty sure it's a great So movie. this is for everybody to catch up to, okay? No. Oh, Wait, oh let me God. water call it. But it was a good movie. I don't want to talk about it anymore. <laughs> oh, he was going in on his fucking journalist, Rose Trans Avenue thought? Media. Yeah, you know, about anyway. The main media. protagonist conceptualized for, for anyway. the, the, the schematics. All right, so Dodgers uh, make some fucking candles. What do they smell like, huh? <laughs> fucking. <laughs> what the there, fuck do they smell like? There go. There's a Dodger. You go. <laughs> what what, 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 what the fuck do you think they smell like? The candles? The Vic, candles. Is a, Vic is a fighter off tequila. I never knew. <laughs> oh, my God. The candles smell like if white old people had a baby with a chola and a chola. Well, explain, explain. <laughs> explain it, nothing. Do us a favor. Okay, so the brand homesick. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah when you're really drinking. Homesick, you taste that shit. Homesick sounds like. Jesus Christ. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Shut the fuck up. Um, the brand homesick makes candles and they do candles of like Los Angeles, Hawaii, blah, 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 whatever. So they're making a candle that is dedicated to Dodger Stadium. That was not me. Excuse me. Okay. Dodger Stadium, yeah. So I asked the guys, if you got a Dodger Stadium candle, what does it smell like? All right. Can we all give our five choices? Five choices. <laughs> I know what it smells like. Give one choice. All give right. one scent. A Nissan Altima. <laughs> Shout out to the Nissans. We always clown them. I have a Nissan Altima. Specifically the Altimas. <laughs> I love the Altima. One of the best cars I ever chosen. It's a reliable vehicle. What about you, Vic? I feel like it smells like peanuts. Bud Light and cool water. Okay. Can I, I feel like it smells like michelada. Oh, that's mm, fire. Yeah, clamato, michelada. It smells yeah. like putas and putazos. <laughs> <laughs> Let me go back in. Let me go. We need to go back. <laughs> they said three. It smells like Nissan Atoma, a probation office, a parole office, and hachiros. Hachiros? Hachiros. It smells like Dodger Dog for sure. The new ones that are disgusting. The, you guys have the new dog? The veggie dodger dogs? It's no, just, they're just like, they're, it's not Farmer John anymore, so it's just like some other yeah. weird shit. That's just more like the gold room, the bar on Sunset and, <laughs> and Echo Park. <laughs> smells like metal somehow. Yeah? Yeah. It's going to smell like... Oh, because of their pistols. Or the... Or the cholos the, the, <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hold on. If Brown Bag had a candle, what Ooh. would it smell like? Oh. That's the a good gila. question. <laughs> <laughs> Who can't keep smell? a secret now? <laughs> both of you. Both of you. The answer is both of you. If Brown Bag had a candle, what would it smell like? Oh, I know. Mineral water? Oh, yeah, for sure. Hot Cheetos? Yeah. And, um, and horniness. <laughs> <laughs> That's valid. It would smell like sex. Smell. <laughs> it would smell like you know. vagina. You know. <laughs> when you're horny, you know. <laughs> Salvadorian oh, ceviche. Yeah, yeah. Ah, that's what horniness smells like. No. <laughs> that's fish, dog. <laughs> you don't get it. I didn't get the it. The salvi ceviche. There's no salvi ceviche. My pussy is a salvi ceviche. Oh, I'm my God. Look you. at Carol's face. Sorry, Carol. Jose's like, Jose's in the back like this. Jose's in the back like this. Smells like the thumb tree. <laughs> By the way, Carol, she, she, she came on point with her fit, huh? Yeah, super all brown bag. <laughs> all brown bag, huh? Where'd you Carol, get this onesie from? Carol's our friend. Um, Forever 21. I brought a onesie. I don't know. I feel like Friendsgiving, you always dress up fun vibes. Okay, but yeah, we have a bunch of food in front of us. So we have to shout out everybody. Everybody bought a dish. Brought a dish. Yeah. And bought a dish. Yeah. Um... I just want to put out there that me and my mom are the only ones that actually cook. Me our, and my mom. Me and my me mom. Me and my mom. Me and Chata Nation. What did you do in the cooking? I want to go buy the stuff. Okay, that is not the cooking. <laughs> and she forgot it in the car in the middle of the night. It was cold, like 12. She was working on it, and, and I was cold, fresh up the shower. I could have got sick, and, and I had to go And you went to go, to go get it? Yes. <laughs> but me? I know that you went had to go because she was like... Go get it, we're not gonna cook it. <laughs> That's facts. <laughs> she's like, she's like, if you don't go get it, I'm not gonna make it. I'm like, ah, oh, fuck it. I was like mid Call of Duty game. I had to like caps the word, duck all the way down. 
<laughs> and go get the shit real quick. Vic, what did you bring to the table? Uh, Spanish rice. Because? Because that's what I agreed to do last time. Okay. I and brought Banco Pavos. Yeah, that those were fire. Yeah, shout out to Pupusas Downtown LA, or La Pupusa Downtown LA. I'll put their link, <clears throat> all of that. Great stuff. Great stuff. Um, And then, what did you bring, Maximo? Pumpkin pie. Pumpkin pie. A little pumpkin. Angie brought the plates? <laughs> the drinks. <laughs> she brought drinks. Which beverages. beverages did you bring? I brought the ginger ale. Ginger ale. Wow, ginger ale. Wow, ginger ale. Trash. Huh? Only somebody from OC would go out of pocket like that, huh? Yeah. <laughs> okay. But Thank yeah, you. shout out to us. So we have um, Friendsgiving feast in front of us. We already ate because people always say that we eat on the podcast. But I think we should do a pie eating contest. Do you guys want to take a shot before we do the pie eating contest? Fuck, no. I, I'm down to take a shot after. Okay, Maybe but really, after. I'm telling you, I, my goal is to get drunk this We're pie. drinking. We're, look, we're, we're getting we're there. Getting we're getting there. there. Okay, so right, pick your poison. Drunk. Pick your pick okay. your pie. Shout out Carol, by the way. She brought shout these. out Carol. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, Good Earth Cafe pies. These are the ones I always see. Like in the little display thing, and I never buy them. Which no, is the last one? They're all they're pies. That one? No, I. Oh no, mine's is back there for the house lady with some milk. <laughs> so you guys, you guys are each gonna get a pie and then see who eats the most. Who can eat the eat most? The eat it the fastest. Yeah. Yeah. Eat it the I fastest. Like, I feel yeah. like look, get one of these just yeah. so we can all eat the same thing. So here, I'll take this one. with no hand. <laughs> Everybody, put your thumb in your fist. <laughs> hey, Letty, Letty, no hands. <laughs> All right, you guys play until you try the thumb trick and I save your fucking relationships. Yeah, you going in like that, man? You ready yeah. to win? All right, hold on, 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 hold on. Damn, this is heavy, way. I'm going to die, anyway. Some came to play some. Okay, good. we're just, we're just going to do, what's the, this is a lot. I'm definitely not going to eat all this. Okay, okay, I feel like, okay, for, for, for who could do the biggest bite? Okay. That's more valid. Oh, I like That's, it. I like it. I like yeah. it. I like it. I like That's it. Let's just, just eat the whole thing. Why are we scared? Let the have more practice. <laughs> Shut up, dog. What? Yeah. Man. Why are we gonna eat the whole thing? You'll you eat the whole thing. Let's eat the whole never... shit. Who's gonna win? <laughs> ah! Who you got? He, he's like super aggressive today. Yeah. What's That's going on? You look at the horns. Super. No, it was a non Wakanda conversation. Let's see how big your bite is. Biggest bite. Go at the same time. Let's all just eat the whole shit. No, I'm not eating the whole thing. You're a liar, ass. Bro. I'm gonna eat the whole thing. All right, all right, all right. just the biggest bite. All the biggest bite, time. we get it. Okay, that's who does it. Uh, biggest bite. The... I have a small jaw, <laughs> but I'm gonna eat the whole thing. All okay, right, one, two. one, two, three. <laughs> all right, one. I'm gonna eat the whole thing. Okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. This is delicious. With some milk, it would have smacked. No, and for our audio people, my bad, man. ASMR, 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 yeah. This is a pumpkin pie. <laughs> <laughs> That's really good, but I know if I drink. Oh my god. If I eat it, and if I fucking eat, <laughs> can't fucking eat. Hold up. Hold up. <laughs> 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 if, I, if I eat the pie and drink at the same time, I get chorro away. <laughs> it's better than getting chorra. <laughs> no, for, no, for, I don't want to get chorro while giving the chorra, you know what I mean? <laughs> There's another horneado story. Uh -oh. People was, love your stories. I know, facts, facts. Shout out to people. We went on a Vegas trip as a friend group and we're all still together. So my friends don't talk to each other no more, but Aww. it's okay. We, I thought you're the solution person. Yeah, you can't solute some fucking <laughs> scaling that shit. Mm. Sometimes you just gotta let, let people go their own way. Yeah. But you know, Vegas, it was it, it was cracking, you feel me? It was a vibe. And I was like hit but I was like drunk, blacked out. I was hitting it from the back, and while I was hitting it from the back, I had to throw up and I had to stop mid. Is that when you spit back? <laughs> no. That would have been vomit back. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Vic. No one's, Keep going. Keep going. No one's competing with Keep you. Going. <laughs> He's competing with himself. <laughs> Vic is still eating. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. So you're like the kid from um, Matilda. Yes. I like no, that you've seen Matilda, the one that has to eat the cake, the chocolate cake. Yeah, that's so fucked up. Yeah, super that's fucked super fat phobic. That would have not been allowed now. Yeah. Just want to put that out there that that kid went through some trauma. Yeah. But <laughs> he was, he ate really well. I know. And then he burped and he passed out. That's so fucked up. This, the, the principal literally had this fat kid go up there and just. Eat a chocolate cake until he can't more, and everybody was just cheering him on. Yeah, that's that's fat phobic right okay, there. Okay, so you vomited on a girl's back? No, I didn't vomit oh. on her back. I was hitting from the back, and then I had to maneuver to the bathroom. And the next morning, I woke up, and she had like a she had like a toothbrush, a toothpaste, and like some Advil and a ginger ale. I was like, "Good morning." 
That was cute, right? That was cute. Did you keep her? No. <laughs> <laughs> it was just a Vegas trip. <laughs> <laughs> you ever like fall in love just for a trip? Oh yeah. You have, right? Oh yeah. Like just on vacation, you're in love. Just the vibe. And then days. you come back to reality, you're like, ah, I'm cool. I yeah. used to fall in love in a freeway drive. <laughs> like next to like like the people driving. Like I would look you? in the other car. Have we talked about this? I would look I in the other cars that. for like cute little boys and be like, oh, he's my boyfriend. Oh, yeah. oh you did And like, like wait for like, like kid, my though. dad to like drive up or whatever and just like try to steal a glance. I definitely I had the homie speed up when we, see some, the girl? when we see some baddies driving next to us. Like speed up, speed up. And then we go next to them and they're like, no play. No. I, but, but I have been recognized when we try to get at girls before. And then you know what I did? I went into my Snapchat, and then there's a QR code, and I just pointed it. So they can follow you. And then she added me through, like, her camera. She was kind of weird, so I didn't even, like, we were talking, but it was like, it got weird. Why? I don't know. It just got weird. She wanted to do butt stuff? Or what? Nah, nah, she didn't want to do no butt stuff, but she was like, yeah, oh, fuck it. I was like, kick it. She like, I'm going to church on Sunday if you want to come. I'm like, mm. The fuck? She's so weird. All the faith that she has. <laughs> she wanted me to meet God. <laughs> She's like, this is going to be like three months <laughs> before anything happens. Yeah, like you want me to meet God on the first day? Four cars. <laughs> like, You're talking like that, Vic. Before anything happens. Like meeting God right away is crazy with you. <laughs> when you and Jorge got the, the, the marriage thing, did you guys go to church? It's the marriage thing. <laughs> when we got married. When you guys got married? It's the marriage thing. I can't wait for you and Honey's wedding. Yeah. Like, I'm very excited for it. Like, who, what rapper's going to perform? Yes. <laughs> like, <laughs> you think I'm going to tell you what the secrets you can't keep? <laughs> Is Angie going to be allowed to bring her cell phone? No, Angie. Uh, they're going to have... Oh, I saw that. <laughs> There's a school that's making all the kids use the, put their cell phones in, like, those one things that keep your cell phone locked up. You know, usually they have, like, at the Dave Chappelle, co- yeah. like, show or like, something. Yeah, like, comedy shows. The phone zipper. They ha- yeah, the phone zipper things. That they have to keep it um, in those um, until lunch or after school. Which, my brain went really dark really quick. Because first it's like, oh, okay, that's a good idea. Like, these motherfuckers won't be but on the phone. But then all the shit that's happened before. But then before. if some shit happens, yeah. like, now these motherfuckers can't even call the cops or call for help. Yeah. So then I thought. I don't know. That could be tricky. How would you feel if they did that at, at your guys kid's school? Well, obviously, well, you're, for, for your yeah, family, I mean, Lil Vic takes his phone to school, but he turns it off, puts it on the bottom of like his backpack or whatever. So, so I mean, think? he can't use it. No, he, does, oh. he doesn't. He doesn't. Knowing him, he would like text me mid like phone mid midday and then just be like, "Hey, Dad, can I buy some of this?" Yeah. Um, but no, I mean, he doesn't use it during the day, but like he has it. Like it's not like in a pouch or anything. Yeah. I'm sure like in an emergency, like he can call me or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. no facts. For parents with kids in high school and for kids in high school that are watching this, I'm sorry for everything you just heard. Um, but how do you guys cheat in school? Because I hear like you can airdrop now. Like Ooh. imagine if you're in school and you had airdrop, dog. Sending fuck freaking photos, well, answers. That. You did. Oh, you had that. You had that. In, you had airdrop in school, bro. <laughs> yes. Kids had it. So airdrop much is like two years old. No, it's not. No. You had airdrop. Dog, I was in high school four years ago. What? <laughs> I had airdrop. What? Or, Wait, hold on. <laughs> hold on. Duno's twenty-two. I was in high school like four or five years ago. Four or four years ago. Twenty nineteen eighteen. Yeah. Oh, all right. Four years ago. That's the truth. Damn, what are you for doing? I was in high school 12 years ago. It's crazy. Fuck. But Dang. look, but look, but look, but look, one thing, nah, well, you know what's crazy? You know what's crazy? That honestly, I think it also fucked up like the the relationships like in the classes. Like, like the teachers kind of they didn't have like no choice. You know what they had to do? Switch like the like your classes and shit. Huh? So, like, you know what I mean? Like they would have to like, okay, you like, okay, so let's say you're used to being your sixth period, right? So fucking your with the car you're doing your test last. And let's just say one of your homies is in third period, they'll like switch it up and shit like that. So your smart homie can't give you like the answers and shit like that. Or they'll switch up the test for everybody. Everybody got a different test. Mm. Mm. And 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 not exactly a different test, but they'll just like let's say if your question's number five, that'll be number mm-hmm. one for them. Mm-hmm. Right. So we wouldn't be able to like share the con- the questions and shit like that. We still super cheated though. I couldn't cheat really, besides um, writing answers down on my hands. Mm-hmm. That's like the only way we could cheat back then. Really? Yeah. How else would you cheat? Yeah. Damn, that's like the phone sucks. game was not like how it is now. Yeah. Oh well, we used to be on it, and with these, and certain schools, they had like the thing where they would um, where there was no signal in the schools, so we would have to download VPNs, 
and oh. then VPN and then connect to the LA USD Wi Fi. And then they wonder why there's so many scammers because you guys had to make yeah. you you made us start scamming so young. <laughs> That's great. Yeah. And wow. then the LA USD, the Wi Fi only lets you use like only LAUSD.com or like Google. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We had that where like the Wi Fi was blocked like, to Yeah, so you have to go to like on proxies and shit. Yeah, yeah so we'd go on VPN and then the VPN would let us use Instagram and connect to like Apple Music and Spotify and shit like that to bump Damn, that's to crazy. bump all the music mm. we wanted to bump SoundCloud, YouTube, and shit like that. That's wild. Shout out the VPN, bro. Fools Shout are looking at, at porn in the computer lab or what? Oh, nah, you're nice. active. You were doing, but, but yeah, there was always like one that one or two. But like there. somebody always got caught. Like there was, yeah, there was porn in the computer lab again. And I was like, Damn, there, was, there was like that's that. extra holding you though. And then and and then that just sucked if you had assigned to one computer and there's six periods and let's say the kid from first period watches the porn. <laughs> And you open your laptop second period, you get caught. You're the one that gets in trouble. <laughs> like, fuck. Oh, shit. I didn't know this was going down. Bro, <laughs> com- computer labs were freaking. Computer lab was active. And then yeah. people figured out All how to play. All I wanted play... to do is figure out how to get on freaking MySpace in my computer lab. How do I get people on to change to, the code to my profile? People used to play the Nervous game in the computer lab sure. in my school. Shout out to Are You Nervous? I never played the Nervous I game. I loved the com- Are You Nervous. Because everyone was always nervous. <laughs> <laughs> like they would touch your knee nervous nervous are you nervous yes I'm so nervous damn <laughs> <laughs> did you guys ever go to school with a girl that got caught smashing in, in, in school no really yeah. I know some girls that got caught smashing in the fourth floor in and the, the whole school floor. knew yeah and that's embarrassing she was a sinvergüenza too she didn't give a fuck damn super activa one of my homies got caught going into the girl's bathroom with his girlfriend at the time and then he got like in so much trouble, and then his dumbass like got her pregnant like a month later, after getting in trouble for that. Like it was just like he had like a terrible fucking senior year. Fucking Jakarta just told me that I forgot a double wanker in PE in continuation school, which I don't expect nothing. Well, else. shout out to Pico Rivera's own Christian Rola- Roldan asked to play for the USA in World Cup. World Cup is coming, you guys. Yeah. Southeast. What a what. What is this dweeb doing? Pico Rivera. Dweeb, <laughs> he's a, what the he's fuck? Pico Rivera, he's going to play for USA team. Although it is weird that he's playing for USA team. Well, he's, 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 I think there's like, I think there's like rules to what, what, what country you can play with. I don't know if yeah, freaking Juan have... Toscano can play for the Mexican team. Yeah, but, but yeah. basketball is different. The FIFA, I think you got to live like in the country I have over like, like seven years citizenship. and citizenship and stuff like that. I don't know. Wait, I'll so. see David Beckham in freaking Spain or something. <laughs> no, that's I don't know how that um, works. So he's playing for the USA yeah. national team? Yeah. And he's from Pico Rivera. Yeah. Wow, Vic, you guys got one. You got one, Vic. The Southeast. Not from Pico, but yeah, the Southeast. There's a That's pretty fire though. There is a documentary that's about to come up, come out just in time for like uh like World Cup. And it's called like um Good Neighbor. And it it documents the rivalry in soccer between Mexico and USA and how just big the rivalry is and how Mexico always would tap that ass. And then I guess Donovan came and all these motherfuckers for the Landon USA Donovan, team. Yeah. So then it, it like it like chronicles that, and I cannot wait to watch it. That's I know because I wonder even, how they're gonna make the Mexico team look. But even like how they're saying like we'll root for ev- like we'll root for Mexico beyond anything else. Like that's where that that's where alliance lies. And then after Mexico loses, what team are you going for? It's usually not even the USA. It's Spain. usually like Brazil. <laughs> <laughs> I go. I'll go for like Argentina. I'll go for like any Latino country that's in the. Yeah, in the yeah and then and then usually like the people that go for USA are like Savis. Okay. Okay. No. Okay. okay. Hold on. Can we talk about Maximo. how? Am I lying? No. 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 Actually, no. You know who they go? For? No. You know who they go for? Salvi and their team USA. What's no? no. They go. Yes. No. They Shut go them. for Brazil. Everyone goes oh, Brazil. The All the they answer. swear they're Brazilian during World Cup time. They're like, we won. I'm like, no, you fucking didn't. You didn't qualify. But anyway. Wow. Um, Salvi's Half al- of me is very offended. <laughs> Salvi's always go for the team that's going against Mexico. Oh, yeah. That's example. Okay. Example. We're playing Argentina. That's who the Salvadorians are going to go for. And that's just fact. You guys are fucking trash. Uh, I go for Mexico. <laughs> and, and you're half. So you, you're kind of... For you're in a good position. Like, even if Mexico gets out, you're allowed to go for USA. I, I, I wouldn't look down upon you if you yeah. did that. <laughs> but I'm just saying, like, most Savis, they love anything that's against Mexico. And I feel it. We've been whooping your ass for so long. Yeah. Like, you feel me? Like, if you can't beat us, you know, join the team that might be able to beat us. And even then, those teams are kind of like, uh. Or how about join us? Right. Maybe it's hard for other ethnicities not to fuck, like, to fuck with Mexicans. Why? Because Mexicans think they're all conceited. We're all conceited. 
your your parents had a great relationship. Look, they had you and your They're sister. They're divorced. Oh shit. Well, yeah, maybe. You know? <laughs> <laughs> They're divorced. Okay. Well, no. You <laughs> okay? What else do you guys want to talk about? But yeah, man, shout out to Salvi that are gonna be shout going out against to us. No. Come the on. crazy part is that the games are gonna be like at eight a.m. Yeah. You're gonna be a part. That's gonna actually be always fun. So like, you. I love early morning games. Mm-hmm. Well, we want to like broadcast live from like a Dave and Buster's or like Barney's Beanery or some shit. You know? Oh, that's fire! Yeah, it's gonna be cool. If I remember we when could, we could hit like some bars right at there. eight a.m. Yeah. yeah, we should do a watch party somewhere. That'll be fire. They last time they had like a um, like an Irish pub or some Oof. shit right there on Melrose. Yeah, they'd be going deep on the soccer games. Damn, I. For usually what I do is, is fucking like go to a Savvy household and watch the Mexico <laughs> games. So you can fucking. So I can just be like, yeah. You can just talk shit. I'd be like, damn, they're in Katara. 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 Is it Katara? Katara. What is it? Katar. Oh, Katara. Yeah. Katara. That was my that was my first choice. Katara's oh, Katara's your artist though. That's a guitar. Katana. Katana. It's a guitar. <laughs> Did you guys watch the Dave Chappelle on SNL? Yes. I did. His watch. monologue oh. was incredible. No, that one. That one you can ruin. Go ahead, talk about it. <laughs> but I did hear that he brought up Kanye West and Kyrie Irving. Did he go in on them crazy? No, no, he didn't actually. It was pretty funny. He just said that Kanye got in so much trouble, Kyrie got in trouble. Yeah. And I thought that was funny because well, like, well, it's like when when your homie is like, like when your homie does something so bad, or you're like your sibling does something so bad trouble. that you get in trouble for it. Like it's like, oh, them, Fuck. they fucked up. <laughs> What's the worst trouble your homies gotten you into? Like mm. that wasn't your shit, but that was your. Sh- Mine is when Angie um, made <laughs> Jake Cole not fuck with me anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Have you heard from him since? I have not, <laughs> but it's fine. Oh, it's shit. fine. They haven't Angie. come to LA. They haven't come to LA. Angie, you really fucked up. Let's relate. It's okay. It's okay. That's what it's you okay. think. <laughs> Angie's worth it. Okay. Was you know they're like go, here all the time. Next time you go backstage, you're gonna have the zipper thing. Yeah. <laughs> you're gonna think. You're gonna take Angie's phone and flush no it out the toilet. No plus one. No plus one. Uh, I feel like the mo- I've gotten my friend in like a lot of trouble before. Um, I ha- I threw like when my, my dad went to Chicago and I was like a junior. He was like gone for like a month, and so the house was open. So I was like, eventually, you know, throwing parties. And my homie, my best friend Frankie, he was um, there with me, and then my cousin was there. It was like us three like throwing the parties and shit. And then whoa, the bottle don't lie, but hey, don't forget the thumb. This shit is so gross, you guys. <laughs> I drink this shit. This shit you forgot your own rule. Um, yeah, thanks. But yeah, and then. Uh, we got we threw a party. Cops came over, like cops came over, like insane. to kick it. No, like they're <laughs> yeah. trying to like they're trying to come in our house. But I had just done a um a class about with, law about law and like you don't have to answer the door type shit. So I didn't answer the door, and they came in my backyard looking. And then eventually, like my fucking snitch ass neighbor um, called your dad. Yeah, I called my dad and told told him <laughs> like how Duno's finishing. And then uh, <laughs> story. I'm just trying to think. I'm trying. Hurry to, up! Yeah, no, I'm, I'm no like trying to think story. about. It. I'm having like a uh, all right. <laughs> anyway, point is, I, he got in so much trouble because like this is a stupid story. Let's move on. <laughs> <laughs> the next one. No, it was nothing. It was a terrible story. That shit was all right, let's move on. Jesus. All right. Anyways, moving on. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but in the Dave Chappelle SNL, I'm trying to crack your finger. I like that they did a House of Dragons skit. So incest. It was funny. Okay. Because they brought out like the the um, Tyrone Biggums and they brought uh, out like uh, I'm Rick James, Rich. Like they no brought, way. he brought out those characters. Oh, of I his. didn't know that. That's yeah, that's really the one good. skit I didn't watch. I should have watched it. It's really good. You brought okay. those characters out with the House of Dragons in the House of Dragons skit. That's As a part of the skit. Yeah. Like saying like, oh, they've come to support the queen in the in the show, and then it's just them being hilarious. Okay, yeah, but watch nobody watched it. So I know. well, I didn't watch that one, but I saw the one where he made um, the dude Mikey do Day his, yeah. do his skit for like him. Heaven. That shit was funny as fuck. He kept trying to get him to say like the N word and shit. <laughs> He's you like, have to I'm watch not the saying skit. that. I'm not you saying have to that. Watch the skit. <laughs> okay, Edgar Report. What's up? Boom! 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 So this was a dope. Um, this was a, a dope video that went viral online. Shout out Jose for sending it. Sending it to me. I was looking um, super musty at work today, so I, oh, yeah. I let my student cut my hair. So a teacher let a student cut his hair. He has like a mullet. In How are kids allowed to bring in to bring all this shit, right? Freaking barber tools into school. You so he gave that. him a sick ass how uh, taper on the park bench, like it's the like quad a bench. Shout I out to him, but it's cool. It shows like cool solidarity. 
Yeah. That that teacher's obviously like one of the cool teachers. He looks like that fool looks hella. That fool looks like fucking like he's probably like 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 late twenties, early thirties or whatever. But I thought it was cool because it's like you could like make fun of him or like whatever. Yeah. But like he's supporting them, putting it online. And I bet you that kid is gonna be like a lot more booked. I bet you he's gonna be like. Well, you know what's crazy? Bread. That kid probably cuts hair at school, which is yeah. a hustle. Like our hustle was like kids selling freaking candy, candy at school, hot Cheetos and shit. Yeah. This was but this was lining out fools food, up yeah. at the. Cl- oh man, wow. if I was in school and I'll be getting lined up every day at lunch. That's I go like one time I walked out out of the bathroom and the homie was getting the lineup by another homie. I'm like, <laughs> what the fuck? And we made him believe that his hair was fucked up for like a whole week. Oh, yeah. Like, damn, he pushed you back. I but- got pierced in high school. I got my tongue pierced in high school. Shout out to all the brown bag baddies that have gotten pierced in school. That's where it happened. Cause that is not yeah. Your parents the- are not going to let you. Oh, and then how'd Hold you on. hide it? That is you not the it's fucking bad. same thing. No, no, no. It's kind of the same thing. No, He's that is doing so- shit at school. Yeah, He's it's like ratchet shit, shit with your friends. Yeah. yeah. Getting your fucking a hole through your tongue? Yeah. Who, who pierced you? And then it was also like really <laughs> scary. It was a chola? It was super chola. All the cholas knew. What was yeah. They knew where not to hit the vein and all that. Oh, yeah. Pinks. Shout out to Pinks. Um, <laughs> that was her name? Yeah, that was her name. She and she has, could fight. So. She probably got like four kids right now. Probably. And she could fight. So. Did. And then they did, um, my friend Frida did the one under my lip. Her name was Frida? Yeah. Oh, I know she had but fucking. But she was, she was Armenian. Oh, but she yeah. was chola. Yeah, she was chola. Like, oh, she was like, like the Frida. Mexican. Yeah. Armenian girl. Then you have a whole other life. I, if, I meet, other life if I want to meet people you went to high school with. You, I want you to meet me in high school. <laughs> you saw my chola photos. Oh, dude. Do you know people that went to school with the Kardashians? No. Because that's different. I'm Glendale. I think they're like rich people shit. They no, were in Glendale too, though. No, they weren't in Glendale. Oh, they they know Glendale, but they oh. they lived in like rich mm. people shit. Dude. They've been rich their whole life. For, for the ever kid, random DMs like, hey... Fucking Letty, what up? Yeah, I she pinks. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What's up, girl? She's what up, like, pinks? She's the shit, though. Those are like the, like, I always big up the cholas in my school because they were always the cool bitches, the down bitches, the one that would teach you how to fight, that had your back, that all of this shit. Like, and also pierced your fucking and tongue. And pierced my tongue. That that's is a so, bond that's that you share forever. For, forever, dog. Yeah. That's what I'm not doing. You never yeah. got a piercing? Not in fucking school. But you never got a piercing? Never. Oh, okay, but you haven't had a piercing, so you don't know. Have you had a piercing? No. Nobody? How long did you have your uh, tongue pierced? My tongue? Damn, I did the the two. I was like in super nah, active. Damn. <laughs> damn. 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 Ooh, fuck with me, dog. And the underlip. Y'all couldn't say shit yeah, to me. You're wow. Wow. Did you? Huh? Yeah, I had the underlip. Damn, I think I even did the one on the side for uh, a little bit. Oh, you were wow. a hoochie. Yeah. Duh. Proud of it. <laughs> this one? I didn't, I didn't you do that one. You had the eyebrow one? No, I didn't do that, that one. That was super Whoa. active. Yeah. That's great. Well, I want to tell you the feels creep. like you guys are judging me, so let's move on to the next one. Okay. No, no, okay, I'm not judging. I'm not someone. touching nobody. But, dude, on fucking Friday night, uh-huh. whatever, I go party, right? I go party like in Hermosa Beach with the homies, with the homegirls. We go pick up the other homegirl. It's about to be her birthday. We're maneuvering to an after hour spot. We get stuck on the freeway in Paramount on the 710. There's a big ass accident in two hours. Me, the homie Major Hype, and the two homegirls walk out the freeway like, fuck it, we're gonna call an Uber. No Uber's coming. I'm in front of the Jack in the Box. Um, Kylie, where am I by? You're literally in the East Side Paramount. Like, like, East, East, East Paramount. Like right, 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 right. I, I, I didn't call I know, that was my first question. You'll pass that? Right before the Home Depot. Oh, right there, it was like hey, almost by Compton. The Jack in the Box. Hey, Vic, yeah. Drink. So, so it was almost Compton. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm, so I'm at the. I like, see this car. Boys are getting like big. <laughs> look, 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 look. So I, so I see this car. We're waiting in the gas station. I finally decided to call Kylie. I didn't want to bug Kylie. It was late night. It was like 4 a.m. almost. Late night. And it was like, and I was like, fuck. I don't want to call this fucking bug him. I've been talking shit to him all week. Kind of him, kind of him about him and your relationship. And like, I was like, fuck <laughs> it. I was like, Kylie, you can school me. He's like, yeah, fuck. I'm on my way. Don't trip. I'm like, gracias. Wrong. And he was like, ah. He says that? No, he doesn't say that. <laughs> a car pulls up. It's just me, Major, I've been the two homegirls. I'm like, fuck, oh, what shit. if they just start chirping? They're drunk. They're bumpy loud. They get off the whip. Okay, I'm scared. I'm scared. What they happened? Get, they get foot. True story. I swear to God. Kylie, what were we telling you about this shit? We get off the whip and the food that's most, the most banged down one. Do no. Amazing. And I'm like, what's up, bro? He's like, I'm a fucking fan of all the shit you do, dog. I watched No Jumper. I watched The Brown Bag. Amazing. And then he's walking up to me, and he's bloody as shit. Oh. And I'm like, what happened, dog? And he's like, 
man, you know, we got in this five me, and then it's, it's and then it's four of them. One of them has a ripped shirt, another one looks okay. One of them has like a like a bump in his face. I'm like, what happened? He's like, we were in Long Beach, off of like the the the, the downtown, like the, yeah, on Pine, yeah. And then they were like, man, and fucking fool, we got into a rumble, fool. I know it looks like we lost, but we didn't, dog. <laughs> oh, my mom, this is what he told me. You should see the other guy. And, and then he's bleeding, though, and he's like, it's not even the worst of it. Boo. He go, he's bald. Think about it like this. He's from East LA. Shout out, bro. He's from East Los Angeles. East Los. But he was coming from Long Beach. They, I guess they got off Long in, Beach? in Paramount to fucking Paramount. pump gas. Pump he gas. takes off his hat. <laughs> he's tied all over his hat. He has a big-ass stab wound right here. Oh, and no. And I'm like, dog, what the? He's like... I got stabbed, but I'm good, fool. I'm good. Oh my god! And I'm like, god. dog, you gotta go. To, I'm like, I'm like, look, fool. <laughs> now Dino's like, giving him medical advice. Bro, I'm telling <laughs> you, and he's like, and he's like, fuck him, get a picture. <laughs> I took a picture, of him, bro. I took a. I swear to God, hopefully he posted. I took a picture, of him, bro. Him and his homies were super. Hopefully cool. he survives. <laughs> 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 hey, Watch, Duno's I feel like the nobody's gonna believe him. him. Yeah. No, no. I, I, they interrogate Duno because he's the last person that saw him alive. Fuck. <laughs> Let's pray for that guy. Hopefully he's yeah, good. Oh but dog, God. I'm like, I'm like, hey, wait. I'm like, you gotta go to the hospital for. He's like, lucky for my parole. I don't want to go to the hospital. Oh. And I'm like, and I'm like, and then I'm like, and then his homie was like, yeah, don't you? We're gonna put um, what's the brown one? Not alcohol. Peroxide. Oh, peroxide, peroxide on like, his head. He's like, he's like, don't trip. We're gonna put peroxide, fool. <laughs> And oh. I'm like, dog, I still feel like you should really go to the hospital. No, and he's like, bro. and he's like, fool, there's nothing a little bud and some fucking alcohol can't fix. And I'm like, you know what, better you be safe. I mean, and he's like, hey, do not like hella cool though. Did you get his name? I didn't get his name. I wish I did. I but feel like you shouldn't. But you shouldn't give his name. You know, this type of shit he got going on. No, 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 but yeah, they, no they're a fly. You, you could tell like you that's know, the, a le legend. Legend, sorry. legend. Dog, wow. but he, and then he had like a big ass E side on his head, wow. tied all over. But he was like. Like, I got off and I'm like, oh, I think he's the one that's going to trip. Yeah, he's and he's right. like, dude, no. Like, loud as fuck. And he's like, I love your videos, dog. He watches brown bag? And he watches brown bag. And, wow, and, shout and, out to and, you, And bro. he mentioned, a, but he was also drunk. So maybe he just mentioned and shit sad, that I do. Yeah. He just probably like, but we took a picture. And one of his homies didn't know who I was. He's like, here we are, fool. He's like, shut up, fool. I'm talking to Duno right now. Aww. And then we're like talking. But hella cool. But I'm like, doggy. And the stab wound is like in his head, dog. Like, yeah. like, like. And I'm like, Tug, you gotta go to the hospital. He's so like, So if they won, imagine the other guys. Oh, yeah. I didn't know. Certain guy, right before he left, he's like, Duno, I know it looks like we didn't win, but we did. Fool. Yeah. <laughs> but hella cool. Shout out, bro, because being that positive while stabbing in your head and meeting somebody you fuck with, like, if I get like beat up and I'm stabbed and I get in the middle of a fucking freeway and I go and like, right. and I run into Dom, it's like, I'm not gonna say nothing. Yeah, you are. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you are. Hey, dog. Hey, dog. You should see the other guys. Yeah, I swear I would, dog. I swear I would. Before we got in the fire, we're about me with self. From the west side, we love. And I was like, bro, but that shit, I'm like, dog, you have a legit stab wound in your head, dog. And he's like, I'll be good for nothing. Some bud and alcohol can't oh fix. Oh, my goodness gracious. And I'm like, oh, you're active. You call it bud. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> that's some old ass shit. Shout out the Tolos. I love the brown bag. The They're the, like yeah. the most, because they, they say like some funny shit. Like one time the other one was like, oh, Okay, let's take a shot for that Cholo. Yeah, shot. And, 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 and the head. And for the stab wound. And for the stab wound. I'm yeah. like, oh. oh. They probably put some Casamigos on the fucking stab wound. The fucking. Hey, the... You, just, you kiss the bottle. I drank some food. No, drink, waterfall it. I know, bro. I've been waterfalling it. Don't I promise you, I drank some. I'm not lying. What's the craziest shit that happened to you off Casamigos, Vic? Off Casamigos? Ah, man. Honestly, there's a lot of shit I don't be remembering off Casamigos. Um, I don't know. I mean, I guess, I feel like I already talked about it, but when that girl was, like, throwing up in front of my house, and then her boyfriend came and picked her up. And then I went so inside. Oh, my God. That's so gross. How do you guys bring Casamigos? And then I went inside and threw up in my sink. So that was, like, no, that all happened within, like, five minutes. Don't know. Julio's worse, bro. She threw up in your car? Oh. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie, for you threw up in your sink, you're a dirtbag. Yeah, I didn't like, have a choice, bro. What about the choice. toilet? It was like, it was, I didn't have any time. Oh, the sink it was? <laughs> it was just like, you know? That's, that's valid. Yeah. It was, it was one song when you guys are at a king set that you guys, Never forget Suavemente. to yeah. <laughs> No, no, no. What's like the one song that you don't ever forget to dance? Oh, not, mine's is the um the fuck Oye Mi Amor by Mana. Oh yeah. Like oh, I always yeah, gotta I dance. Shout out to Rock in Español. Yeah. It's the best 
like steps ever. Everyone can dance broken in Spanish. That's facts. I, I really like Trenal Sur too. Trenars. They're no, Spaniard too. Also, Besame Mucho is coming out too. So, whoa, oh, yeah. oh, we that. gotta go to Besame hey, Mucho primo. at Dodger Stadium. Hola, primo. Tom? If you're listening, uh, uh, not no. Tom. Primo. primo, 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 please. And yeah, shout out to my mom because we did one of the best skits for Besame Mucho. Who? Yeah, my mom. Yeah, me and my mom. We did a skit for Besame uh, Mucho. It came primo. out. Primo. Yeah, it came out of Ben. She promoted when the first job. Oh. Primo, please. I ain't gonna lie. That list. That's like that's like one of those liners where you're like. Fuck, where am I gonna go? Yeah, we need to figure out our outfit for that. Oh, yeah, we should have a whole brown. Remember, we wanted to be like Banda Machos, but brown bag, yeah, I know. But like, fun. Banda brown bag would be fucking lit, dog. And we sing Ya Superame, and fucking Ooh. no se va, no, no se, se va. va, no, that'll be fire. I could do the, the little steps. Like, you just need a trumpet in your hand, and then you just like go this way, and then you go this way, and then go this way. Go this way, go this way. Okay, it's Friendsgiving. So we're going to do oh, a Friendsgiving Homie Awards, okay? Homies! Can we do it for people that have... No, nah, never mind. Okay, just people here? Yeah, people okay. here. Okay. Can I go first? Yes, go ahead. All right. And you guys, this is going based off everybody behind the scenes? And in front and, of the scenes. And in front of the scenes. Um, okay. <laughs> um, worst texture goes to Dom. <laughs> <laughs> is homie. Worst texture goes to you. Yeah, you, you have us on uh, Do Not Disturb. You haven't replied to the last six of my texts. <laughs> what do you mean? You're the worst you. texter, dog. Josh, I send you voice messages. Okay, okay, okay. I'll take that back. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Most emotional friend. Goes to Letty. Oh, yeah. Each other. Everybody clap it up. Yeah. yeah. Well, you yeah. all agree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the competition was stiff, but not stiff enough. <laughs> Most simpiest friend. This splits in two. Goes to Lucha and Cali. Yeah. yeah. Simps. Simps. They got to share the Simps. award. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Funniest. I'm gonna have to give it to Jose. Funniest yeah. award. Yeah. Yeah. He did good. He did good with the jokes. I feel like I could have won that too. You think so? You guys were runner up. Just if you would watch the text, you would walk up on stage, and snatch it. Snatch snatch up. Up. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna let you finish. But. What what award does Vic get? I, I was getting there. Give me that. Okay. Um um. Most improved, Josh. Most improved, Josh. Yeah. Josh. Yeah. Yes, he can Josh make a found real Jesus. Now. Yeah. Yeah. So excited for him. Josh found something down in there, yeah. and he just you know yeah, brought it to yeah. the top. He has a heart out now. <laughs> yeah. Boy, <laughs> didn't have no schedule. Oh man, he, was, he hated leaving here. He's like, everybody leaving now. So what am I gonna do with my life now? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Till next week. Yeah. Most creative. Most creative. I would have to go with Angie and Letty. That okay, one goes for both of you guys. Yeah. I'll share that award. Yeah. And most. Consistent I'm going to have to go with Maximo. Yeah. Yes. And, the and most handy for sure. Yeah, most handy. Most wow. handy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hilarious. <laughs> I am hilarious. And, and, and then most. Five. And then most. Another one, another one, another one. Another one. <laughs> and then, and then, and then. You're hilarious. And then most Dr. Shelvick. Most what? Like, I feel like this, this season, he, you know, he like kind of like. Blossomed. He, yeah, he talked yeah. more. He was clowning more and yeah, more for attractive. Sure. Third yeah. season is is in a whole new Vic. Yeah. A whole new Vic. Hey, by the way, because you said most handy, I was at Best Buy, and this guy's like, Maximo? And I was like, <laughs> what the fuck? What the hell? <laughs> and then he's like, from Brownback, right? And I was Amazing, like, yeah. Amazing, He said, Maximo. I recognize your voice, and I knew it was you because of your hand. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to that guy. Shout, Shout out to that guy. I forgot his fun. name. The Shout out to the Best Buy guy that recognized Maximo. Home Depot, Home Depot. Home Is it Best Buy or Home Depot? Depot? No, Best Buy. Oh, oh yeah. Of course Depot. your nerd ass would wow. be at Best Buy. Fucking wow. Wow. Who brown? gets the most Mexican award? Most, most Mexican most award? Most Mexican homie. Most Mexican? Wow. Honestly, that would have to be split between me. No, all three of us. Because we have a brown bag podcast and we've been kidding it. Hey. But if we're really being honest, it's me. I get the most bandas uh, throughout the year. If we're really being honest, it's Angie. That's fact. Yeah. Yeah. She doesn't even she try. She wears socks with slides. Yeah, yeah she doesn't yeah. even try. She's just so Mexican. She's yes. doing it right now. She's just Mexican. Okay, okay, we're being honest. More chunti goes to Angie. The <laughs> most chunti. <laughs> Thank you. But most like a hot like the Uno, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh what yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, yeah. Who's the most chismoso? Duno, yeah. <laughs> Who is the... Most rich. Jorge. <laughs> Jorge. <laughs> <laughs> My pimp. <laughs> My pimp. Shout out Jorge and Dom. Jorge yeah. and Dom. <laughs> Pretty rich. Okay, now your turn. Pretty rich. No, it's Vic's turn. 
Um, okay, definitely most most toxic. Mm. I got to give that up to Cali. Yeah, <laughs> Cali. And which is crazy because he just entered the race like two weeks ago. Yeah. <laughs> but he passed everybody so fast. <laughs> in the ground running. Yeah, like, you know. Like, I feel like you could have took it home, but no, he's like... Yeah, and I've done dust. some toxic shit. Yeah, no, there's, you didn't stand a chance. I thought I won that. No, you didn't stand nah, a chance. Nah, that fool, that fool. I, I, I can't be ready, ready. Yeah, oh, fuck. Yeah. <laughs> You've been waiting for this moment. <laughs> Dominating every stat. Yeah. yeah. Um, let me see. Uh, I'll, I'll definitely say, like, best under-the-breath comments of all time, Jose. Facts. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he just be mumbling under his breath like some bars. Yeah. I'm like, what Every the time I'm like, how did he think of that? Yeah. We need to give him a mic. We should give him a mic. Because he be saying some funny shit. But he has some edit more shit. He be saying some out of pocket shit, too. True, yeah. <laughs> some shit he would have to edit himself of himself. Yeah, so maybe let's not give him a mic. Uh, he'll edit it out. Don't worry. <laughs> yeah. Um, I want to say uh, best new addition, Lucha. Yeah. Yeah. Lucha. Not exactly sure everything he does, but he did get us... Uh, a lot of views that one episode. Yeah. <laughs> and he brought a lot of good shit this time, so. Funniest homie isn't anybody in this room. It's the motherfuckers in the comments. You guys crack me up sometimes. The shit that motherfuckers come up with in the comments that we end up using and not crediting. <laughs> like, shout out to you guys. <laughs> like two con like true content creators. Yeah, just steal look at from us. the smaller ones. Yep. Great artist steal. <laughs> yeah. Shout out to us. <laughs> um, Josh, definitely most improved. No, for sure, for sure, for sure. Yeah, Josh, we're so proud of you. Yeah. Josh literally used to come, like, he would have a fight or a blackout the night before or both. Yeah, yeah. And, and then now he's just like, he's He used to it. bail out just in time for the show, honestly. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and he's had a consistent with everybody. Shit. Yeah, yeah, I love, I love me. Yeah, shout out Josh, Josh, man. Yeah. He got in his bag and he hasn't got out. Angie's, like, definitely the most, like, how do I say it, like, <laughs> the coolest one, like, like non problematic one. Facts. You know she what I'm saying? She is non problematic. The most non problematic one. She is very. That's super like useful. That's great. You That's know what incredible. I'm saying? Yeah. That's incredible. She you can, can do no wrong. Too. Yeah. She, she can, can take a no, joke. Yeah, she yeah. can take a joke. Yeah, I love she that. She takes our clowns. You guys yeah. clowning her. Super. Active. You clowning her. We beef at me and Angie. Yeah, you do. And then uh, co MVPs, I got to give it up to. Do no let them! Yeah! yeah. We won six man of the year, you fuck. I'm six man of the year, all right? You guys are co MVPs. Yeah. Shout out Letty for coach of the year. Yeah, but not like Emo Udoka kind of coach. You know, like more like. <laughs> Phil Jackson. <laughs> yeah, Phil Jackson. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And then horniest, I mean. Do I don't know. Do I got to say. Everybody Who thinks. is more horny? Maximo? That for the double wankers act. Duno with the landslide oh, no. victory! <laughs> but who's runner up though? Who's runner up? You, Dick. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that was great. Yeah. Are you? Most off my shit list into my friends list is big. Yay! <laughs> That's progress. Yeah, progress. Progress. Coming back. Comeback season. You play like Westbrook. Comeback it's, season. <laughs> hey, we got another win, you guys. We got another win. Yeah. I'm so happy for us. <laughs> Again, dude, Vic, I appreciate you for coming to my parties all the time. Oh, Thanks yeah, you so already much. know. I, I literally have plans way before your party. Everybody else had no fucking excuse. Yeah. Shout out Duna for having great excuses. Yeah. <laughs> I think um, best... Um, I don't know. What the fuck? <laughs> Too drunk for this. Can we just skip to the best dressed? Wow, nobody's gaming. Wow. Wow. Give, give him best dress. For what? For what? what? Say he's a huh? <laughs> <laughs> Is Vic the best dress? Come on. Yes. Okay. Come on. Okay, look, in the comments, you tell us who is the best dress. Not to this episode, clearly. I'm wearing a fucking onesie. Okay, okay. But you like, know what? Hold on, it's not fair. Like, well, actually, I could win this one. But the ones where you got the, you know? <laughs> that's not even fair. They're going to be like, oh, dude, Lefty wins in the landslide, you know? How do you know they're not out this one if you haven't looked? I haven't. And you're wearing a onesie. Yeah. Facts. Look, we could change this shit right now. <laughs> 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 Little puppet. You don't let me win anything. <laughs> I just wanted one thing. <laughs> Skin out of this. Okay, you guys, best dress, bitch. Yeah. yeah. Oh. You 
yeah. Thank you guys. Best Sancho is Duno. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Best Sancho yeah. is Duno. Yeah. Shout out to Mills. Tap in. Tap yeah. in. <laughs> Couple Mills tapped in after that episode. You got respect left? No, bro. People, no, no respect at all. Yes, yes. Actually. Respect in the car. <laughs> bro, people were DMing me like, bro, you've. That was the most accurate shit I've ever seen. Yeah. I'm like, you fools are fucking homewreckers. I did it one time. Fools are consistent with this shit. There's people that are like, oh, that's what this podcast talks about. Like, that's what it glamorizes. Chill out. I wonder how many relationships we've ruined. Yeah, true. But love Vic. <laughs> I could think of a few. <laughs> Vic alone. Vic alone. We're fun. <laughs> we're consistent with Vic's relationships. Best drunk, Letty. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Back. Three shot let the, can three shot let the get her or was it is it three shot let the yeah, four it is, shot let it was four but I need more four shot let the needs her own like I feel award like we're not separately. doing shit to this fucking bottle I feel like I feel like we should make a bottle called four shot let the but it's four shots big no like like it'll be four shots but it's just like it's just like one name it four shot let the and they're just like we'll do like a slogan like you drink four you become a whore you know what I mean oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Not That's you. what happens? No, you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Okay, what about this? You drink four, Vic, you're never bored. Did I mention bored. how much you're my best friend in this podcast? And like literally. I wasn't calling you a whore. The girl best that... from friends list to shit list is Duno. Yeah. Oh, wow. oh, oh my god. That's exciting. No. I was like hearing like when he said, Four. Four. And then I was don't like, don't do say it. it. Don't no, do don't it. do it. <laughs> I'm like, it's too close. It rhymed. Like, I'll what do you think has been the best um, slogan so far that we've come up with? Horny. Fuck with me, dog. Or fuck yeah. with me, dog. Dude, oh, it's top tier. Fuck with me, dog. dog. It's that top is tier. Yeah. Which is, that's a caption. <laughs> He's kissing us. Like, you heard me? You heard me? Oh, I'm kissing us. No, but horny's up there, too. Horny. Like but I feel legend. like legend. No, no, but also fuck with me, dog is more universal. It's more, that's that, what I was about to say. It's it's, it's it's more marketable. Yeah. Marketable is that a word? It's a cuss word. It's a cuss word. I know, but it's way better than horneado. Horneado. Horneado is a good word, man. After get drunk, you guys, you don't understand. Take a fat night. shot, then put it. You're already. I've been drinking shots. Okay, I think you gotta pour them in this. Can you pass me the mineral yeah, water? Not, you guys are just wetting your lips. Pause. Okay, chora. Chora. He's super chorra right now. Super chorra. Shout out to, did we say this already? No. Aleman and Snow the Product, they are in the Wakanda, uh, the Black Fire. Panther Wakanda Forever yeah. soundtrack. Honestly, honestly, that's the only reason I'm going to go watch the movie. No, both of their songs, incredible. You can mm -hmm. listen to it right now. You could go to the, like, I listened to it on Apple Music, but hey, you can listen on Spotify too, just saying. Um, <laughs> but their songs are really good on the on the soundtrack. Oh, can I give a hot take I really, quick? I especially like Snow the Product songs. Um, what? Snow what? the Product what? is... What mineral water, mineral at? water, mineral water. Wait, oh. Snow the Product is a better rapper than Nicki Minaj. Snow the product is a better than rapper than a lot of men in yeah, the game. Yeah, facts. So. facts. facts. And the fact that she can rap like that in Spanish always yes. freaks me out. Like, and sing. Yeah. Gotta give her flowers. Yeah, yeah. A lot of people can do both. In okay. Spanish, is hard, dog. All right, cheers. Cheers to Snow the product. Cheers. And yeah, she sells out Aleman. shows, bro. Yeah. yeah. Cheers to <laughs> Nieve del Producto. Snow the product. Is that it? Is that yeah. it? I don't think so. Yeah, yeah Snow the right, Angie. Yeah, you're right. Okay. See, if my fellow Tunti said I'm right, I'm no, right. No, because someone says nieve is ice cream and not right. snow. He's right, he's right, he's right. Uh, okay, when you go to the snow and you tell your parents you're going to the snow. Burn the burn up. Burn. <laughs> 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 All right, that's what it's talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Call me whore. <laughs> I didn't call you, you whore. You I called you alcoholic beverage whore. <laughs> <laughs> Man, fuck this. Cheers. And for Charlotte. Cheers. Oh my God. Hey, um, who's your hot pass when you were in your past relationship, or maybe with BM, with Bay Mama, where you're like, this is my hot pass? No, you can't tell Salvadorian women you have a hot pass. That part. I definitely told my Salvadorian I know the shit that I say to Jorge, he can never in his life say to me. Ever in his life. Or have a yeah. podcast like this, huh? Yeah, ever in his life. Yeah, it's different. Totally different. It's way different. No, but I he's never... accepted that, okay? I know it's not right. <laughs> I know it's not healthy. <laughs> That's but he has accepted side, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah. It's but the price like, you pay. Yeah, no, nah, I don't think about hall passes now. I really just, I'm kind of like, I want to like DM them and like meet them in real life. Mine is Mila Kunis. I used to tell my sister that all the time. He loves Mila Kunis. I'm like, you guys, if I ever meet Mila Kunis and she's down to, and this is high they're school. They're not going to take a shower together. And I'm like, and I'm like, I'm cracking her. And they're like. I like that. I love how guys are like, that she's going to say yes. <laughs> yeah, Mila Kunis is not fucking with me at all. Like, Maybe one day. Who knows? Ashton, help. <laughs> That's her man. 
I know. <laughs> but if me and Mila Kunis ever come out in a movie together, you guys just know I'm going to shoot my shot. But nah, actually not. Nah, because then, you know, like, if I'm going to go around like, ah, this is doing try to crack me. I'm like 40 years older than him. <laughs> you should just do it. Life is short. Yeah, but then that's, like, Mila Kunis is, like, a very well-known A-list, like, movie star. Like, and I don't want to, like, she's going to black mommy, like, from the thing, you know? Like, I'm going to send her flowers, like, hey, I love you. You're my hot pass. You're and my hot pass. And then they're going to, like, remove me from the movie. Oh, let's talk about this. Cooler culo. Okay. The luchador masks are going to be banned from the World Cup. That's so, that's racist. How do you feel, Lucha, about In that? Qatar. <laughs> okay, for those of you guys who don't know Lucha, he is not just the simp that, that his girl cheated on him. <laughs> and then he went to the back Way more concert. complex. Super more yeah. complex. Like, he is a content he, creator. Yes. He <laughs> likes to wear a luchador mask and just be popping out here in these streets. So that's why we're asking Lucha um, this question. And Lucha, that also- is su- that is sucks. Yeah, <laughs> that is. Su- well, how do you how do you feel about this, Lucha? Free, free, feel free to yell. Speak yell. very yell. loud, Lucha. It sucks because this is like one of the like most like iconic things during the Mexico things. Like everybody comes either with like a painted blue face of the Dodger right. game, or they come with like a Dodger jersey. But for the Mexico games, everybody comes with a Mexico jersey and a Lucha mask. So I feel like a bunch of people are gonna be super pissed off about this. Yeah, and yeah. what's the reason that they're banning it? Just because Mexicans do it? That's I fucked think up. That because the world is so fucked up right now. Like they don't want people like coming in because of like all this just crazy shit that's going on and like they don't that's horrible. Oh, not being able to identify no, them. Nah. Yeah, exactly. It says the Mexican government confirmed the Qatar 2022 organizing committee's choice. Over 50,000 Mexico fans are expected to attend. Um, the country's ministry has a sought clarification. El three supporters are often among the most colorful at the tournament with sombrero de charros, wrestling masks, and renditions of Cielito Lindo. Yet fans are not allowed. Keep going, scrolling down. Yet fans are not allowed to wear lucha libre masks entering the stadiums. Um, they've told Mexican government that the masks are prohibited item, uh, and they've warned Mexico against taking masks to games. That's so fucked up. And it's low key kind of racist. It is not kind of. It really is racist because it's like, hey, Mexican fans, we know you do this shit. Stop it. I'm just afraid to say anything right now. <laughs> <laughs> you can do it. Hold on, but wait. This is stupid because there's mask mandates. Yes. So like we used to have to wear masks yeah. everywhere. And, and now, now you, you don't want masks. What if what if this is like this is obviously gonna protect from COVID? No, you know it's not big. No, it's do you not. see where the fucking holes are? The holes are no. in the nose. Shh, and, and I'm trying it. to get it. I'm trying to get okay. us past this shit. Wow. I, yeah, yeah, that's that's super racist, dog. I'm not a fan and of And look, religious reasons right there. He has a cross on it. On his mask? Yeah. He does have a cross on yeah. his mask. Man, it's for faith that's reasons. super fucked up. Yeah. And they're not really. It feels like we're just being singled out. Yeah. And damn, there's really gonna be Mexico fans that are flying to Qatar. 50,000. That's crazy. Qatar is said to be really hot. That's why they're doing it so late in the year mm-hmm. because it's so hot they couldn't do it in the earlier months. Oh, but, but also, we're known to always bring in a big percentage of the money. <laughs> Like yeah, and like, if they're gonna like, single us out, this is like when you go to the club and they tell you like, oh, you can't wear a hat, but, but then, you're popping like thirty bottles. But, yeah, but no, but and then like Jay Z walks in with the hat, and then I'm just like, oh, come on, Jigga, you know? There's like, levels, Vic. Yeah. Oh no, I've I man, I've been to levels. Let me tell you guys this story. One time, we were walking in with our hats, right, and the the guy was like, hey, no sports attire or, or L A gear, and I'm like, what do you mean? He's like, yeah, you can't do that, and then the homie's like, hey. That's Duno's world. He's good. Ooh. Ooh. Was, you were good. I was super fucking good. <laughs> and then and then and then he he let me in, but he tried to trip on the homies. I'm like, hey, they're with me. They're with me. And yeah, also and something other something dope that also happened. Another news. Santa Fe clan sang to Paquito del Barrio. You guys. That's really cool. That's fire. So they had like this thing like honoring her, where like different artists came and did songs, and Santa Fe clan sang, sang to Paquito del Barrio, Rata de dos Patas. He sang that to her? No, he sang his song to her. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, he sang his song, but it was, you know, kind of dedicated to her and shit like that. Did she sing her song back to him? I don't know exactly what happened, but my mom was telling me, like, this big thing that was going on. That would have been pretty tight. Take the shot, I'm trying. I'm fucking trying. I'm trying. I'm, I'm trying. trying. I'm trying. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying. <laughs> Can we bring Angie in here for Sombra Sala? Yeah, Sombra Sala. fuck out of here, Maximo. Fucking Angie, get over here. Now, do a shot with me. Angie. Sombra Sala. Woohoo! Dígame de Sombra Sala. Oh my God, let me take my shots off. Ooh! Damn. Okay. 
Okay. Sombra sala. Sombra. I was yeah. fucking mm -hmm. drunk. This is a shit show right here. You but feel I that drunk? A shit show. Yeah, pass me the fucking bottle. The Angelica. homie sexting over here. I wasn't sexting. Yeah, you were. <laughs> I'm sending old dick pics. <laughs> old <laughs> dick pics? I'm just joking. Yeah. You have them? Just like saved? No, I don't have them saved. You They're know aged? they can tell the dates, right? How? They just click on it. It gives you the details. Oh, I didn't know that. Come on. Oh, no, you said you. That's fool. toxic. No, we sent them on Snap. In mm, a Snap. <laughs> okay. All right, Angie. guys. So Sombra Sala, um, it's about Aleska Genesis. So if you guys don't know who that is, that's actually. That awesome. oh, was what? <laughs> Okay, let it out. What, what do you want to see about my outfit? <laughs> why are you looking at me? Uh, why'd you say the whole outfit from Fire by the Yeah, Aleska, Aleska, no, let's let her finish. Oh. Yes. I didn't say anything, Angie. Okay. I don't know. I don't have headphones, so I don't know what you guys were Aleska, saying. Aleska, Aleska, we said Aleska. 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 Go, shut okay. your nails. So Aleska, Genesis, that's um, Nikki Jam's ex-girlfriend. Oh. So she was the actually... The white girl, the white girl? Yeah, 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 the white girl. She's a model. She's pretty. Pretty as fuck. Yeah, she's really pretty. So um, there's like vi uh, videos going viral of her, and she's like FaceTiming this bruja, oh, and she's no. doing like brujeria to Nikki Jam. Oh, so shit. Jose, if you could click on it, that's exactly the part where she's like telling, "I want Nikki Jam to be like thinking of me, like obsessed with me. He can't get it up without me, like <sighs> things like that." Crazy about Nikki Jam. Evil world we live in. She looks fucking dead right there. A ver. Well, okay. She's like a character from fucking Coco. And no, 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 you guys no, no. think she, she's pretty? No, no, she's... No, she is pretty. She's the one on the left. She's the one on the oh, left. Oh, yeah, she's not the bruja. Well, I know. The bruja looks like she's fucking... The bruja the fucking the demons right now. Oh, is she wanking it? I was yeah, about to say, what, she what's like, she... What's going on in I don't know Angie? exactly what she's hand. doing with her... But this shit went viral, right? But Angie, it went I'm viral? Assuming? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it went viral, and then Aleska, instead of saying, like, you know what, this is my private life, whatever, what I, or saying sorry, something like that, homegirl no se hace la que no pasa nada, and homegirl saying, like, oh, just wait till Friday at 12, and I'm going to say something. And so then Friday comes, and she's like, oh, you guys think I'm la mala, I'm la bruja, and she drops the fucking perfume. But ho but it's like a whole thing that there's like phone calls, there's videos, there's audio of our states saying that she's doing brujeria. It's not just only Nikki Jam, but then other exes saying that like I want him to feel rem uh, have remorse, like feel really right. bad, uh. and even doing it to like little kids. This to ex. Damn. Well, I haven't seen that part of the video, but it's like, like yeah, I haven't seen that either. She's been going very. I, mean, I hate this bitch. Okay. I'm I would hate ass her. Bitch. I would hate her. Hating ass bitch. Ain't never had nothing good, and when they leave, she's mad and does brujeria ass, bitch. True. So, like all of us. Well, she was only with Nikki Jam for like a couple of months. Oh. Okay. So then, she's psycho. She's salty. She's so, definitely. Mm. Both yeah. Of that. But Salada. like Nikki Jam was gifted, he gave her uh, a Ferrari for Christmas. Oh, yeah, that's gonna make sense. Oh, yeah. Ungrateful. And so then Nikki Jam replied back saying, like, oh, no más Dios sabe. Things like that. Mm. But he didn't really talk about But what's you know what's fucked up about this? And like, if you guys have seen the Nikki Jam thing, on Netflix, he had a really crazy story. Like, yeah. his life was crazy. Yeah. And you could tell how much of a good space. He even had, like, I think where he interviews artists now. Uh -huh. He does yeah. kind of like a podcast. Oh, he does his own podcast? Yeah, he, he did, like, interviews and stuff. Yeah, he, yeah, yeah. That was interviewed, um, Eslabon, Grupo Firme. Mm. And and he, he's done all those interviews. And, he's the and, one with Grupo Firme. Go finish it. Yeah, and, and then he's, like, <laughs> he's super sober. Grupo he's, like, firme. he's, like, that feels like in a really good place. Like, he has oh, a yeah, crazy yeah. story with his mom. So for somebody to do this, because maybe the relationship didn't work, I'm not saying he's perfect, but you could tell, like, he's such in a better place now than he yeah. was while coming up before him and daddy and gave it reunited in. And, uh, you, you know, you make me so proud that you know all this. Come on, come on. I like it, I like you it. You know what I mean? He's I pay most, attention. I know, but I'm surprised that he knows all about You know what I mean? Country. So it's kind of, like, I'm not saying he's perfect, but maybe something just didn't work out, and he, you know, and you can tell he's dealt with so much bullshit that he's probably like, look, if it's not working out, it's better yeah. we're not toxic and just kind of move on. Mm -hmm. And then you want to do some shit like that where you... And if people know, I was... Look, whatever you do, sopa de canzón, oh, yeah, yeah, whatever, yeah. that's oh, on you. But I feel like when people are good people and that happens to them, it's super fucked up. It is. But she's doing it to multiple people. But I was going to tell you, like, oh, yeah, so Nicky Jam, you know how he... Um, Interviewed Grupo Firme? Uh -huh, Grupo Firme. You know that um, Edwin, he went on and he said that, like, oh, yeah, I did cocaine with... Canelo, that was my first time. When he no was, way. Yeah, yeah, he's like, he's talking about it. He's like, yeah, you know, at the fight in Vegas, the one that just happened, he's like, that was the time, the first he time. He said that? Yeah. 
And then oh. the oh is that why he got kicked out of Canelo's house? <laughs> I don't know. Paid in the quince? Yeah. Maybe. Payday, payday. But yeah, that, I thought that. Get that the fuck out of here, like, man. That's what he said after he did the. Hey, Canelo man. don't look like a dick when he's drunk, though, huh? Get the fuck out of here. After Pericas. That's what party like always just like, what fool? So then why do we <laughs> hate does... on Oscar if literally they're doing the same thing? Damn. I don't know. Damn. You know why? It's a bar. You know why? Oh, but you're, you're just finding out. Yeah, that's crazy. I know, because when I heard it too, it was just like, "What, Canelo?" But that shit didn't go to public. It didn't go to public. If you do something with someone, isn't it fucked up if you snitch on them? Try snitching, yeah. Yeah, I'm provoked. Let's just like, I think like you're gonna talk about fucking doing perico with Vic, like that's just fucking stupid. Which we've never done. If if me and Vic never happened. If me and Vic ever do perico, I'm definitely gonna come on here and talk about it. Just like (laughs) Clowny talk. (laughs) No, no, I'm I'm telling the story. Like if me and Vic (laughs) go like on a three day bender. And we're lit and we gotta come film on Monday. What? This be the best story ever. <laughs> Title it. Vic and Duno do Perico. For the first time. For the first time ever. For the views. For the what is going stupid. Oh my god, you guys, you the alcohol her? is hitting. Let's fucking go. Let's, Angie, come on, let's turn up. Let's take another shot. I took a big shot. Take another shot. It's hitting now. Okay, look, ask me look. whatever you guys want. Hold up, let me. Oh. Yes. Oh, it's, <laughs> it's gonna be a lot of editing. No, we're not editing none of this shit. Jose is like, fuck Speed that. Speed round. <laughs> fucking take the shot. Give, give some to Vic. I feel a pussy, dog. He is. But give him some. <laughs> eh! Quiero sentir tu botón. Now he's <laughs> Come on, Vic. Chop it out of Vic, go, 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 oh, go, I'm... go, Vic. Vic, do it for Rosecrans. <laughs> wow, Vic. Let's go, Vic! <laughs> Vic has sex tonight. It's going to be the best. Woo. Go, 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 go. Whiskey Angie! Angie! Cheers, 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 cheers. Oh, it's Angie, it's Friendsgiving, bitch. Friends giving, bitch. It's Friendsgiving. <sighs> ah! On Duno's cup. <laughs> On Duno's cock? Duno's cup! Whoa! What did you say? Cup! I said, Duno's cup. We're drinking off Duno cup. Um, that's, a, that's a crazy Orange County accent that confuses cup with cock. On <laughs> Duno's cock. <laughs> I'm drinking yeah, Duno's cock. <laughs> Cheers, Andy. You're my best friend. Oh, my God. <laughs> have you tried it? Let's have some of Duno's mom's flan. That's just really good. Oh, you're getting the money. Oh. <laughs> Angie, so I what bet, happened with this I girl? She did witchcraft. Try, okay, I just want to talk about this witchcraft real quick. Pass the fork. Everybody wishes their ex bad. I don't care if you're like, oh, we're friends. You never wish your ex better than what you guys could have had or will have or all well, of that. Well, she doesn't have a chance. But I'm just thinking, happen. like, Nikki Jam probably s- yeah. spoiled her. Que quiere for I don't two wish, months. I don't, no, not I don't two months. Wish, it was just a couple months. Fuck it. I don't wish my ex. But yeah, I mean, because you still want to be with your ex. No, no, yeah. Fuck it. I don't miss her. I, I mean, I don't wish her bad. I make. I miss her back. <laughs> <laughs> you miss her butt? Her back. You miss spitting on her back? I like how I just poured out my heart about my ex. Yeah, and you and, guys are and, totally ignoring yeah, my, and, my well, friend. Well, this guy's like, give him the pork. I like just what? The pork? The pork. Pork. On Duno's cock. No, not on my cock. <laughs> Leave my cock out of here. Josh, <laughs> you are too hey, sober for this shit, Josh. Angie's like, give him the pork. <laughs> it's a fork. Shout out my seesaw for making this. She is the most <laughs> juicy. Oh, my mom killed it. <laughs> You're not going to share? <laughs> Your mom killed it. <laughs> so Duno had his mom learn oh how to God. make flan for this especially. Oh, Hold on, so I have to still take this shot. This shot. We're going to eat out the plate. It's going to be too much of it. We're already drunk. Cheers, best friends. Cheers, best friends. Shout out this Cheers party. Cheers to Luis and Jorito. <laughs> Yay. Yay. I, I know that. we're going to caption it. Actually, I don't know what we're going to caption it. Pretty Damn, Chata, Chata did really good on this one. Honestly, she was like, she got like the wrong like tapa lechera. So she's like, I don't know if they're going to like it. And I was like, fool, shut up. Just make it. you guys pass me that mineral water? Nope. You <laughs> passed you the alcohol. Vic, remember last time we got drunk together? Yeah. Oh, I don't want to remember that. <laughs> Wait, but when? You know when, motherfucker. <laughs> oh, shit. That dude's a fucking fool. <laughs> Angie, you know what we're talking about. Oh, the awkward. <laughs> What's your fucking birthday? And fuck she me. was mad at me, and then she got happy. Yeah, fuck <laughs> me. Fuck <laughs> No. <laughs> no. Cut the check, bitches. Oh, God. I'm the happiest drunk in life. <laughs> well, I try a little bit. I'm try super a little bit. happy when I'm drunk. Oh, you want to try a little bit, my phone? I did. It was good, it was good. There's how much I love Duno and his mom. Because that you'll like drink flan, flan yeah, and I feel like shit, I don't too. Like, I don't like flan, and I'm oh, very, yeah. like... Nah, I'm, 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 I'm not, like, I, I, if I could eat some, oh, but not... Good, like, it's good, she killed it, she did. Yeah. Wait, so do you wish bad on your exes, Vic? Hell no. 
I love them. I wish they all them all, all the best. Them? No. Most of them. Lindy hates her ex. Yeah, and I do. What street is I don't that? feel like I'm on bad terms with my ex. There's someone that watches. I'm so sorry. Oh, me and I were talking about this the other day. I know you commented. That, that they Someone live on. commented that they live on the exact street that I say fuck. Because it's, it's, it's fuck Fontana, but I know there's a lot of listeners from Fontana. So not unfuck Fontana. Just fuck Mango Street. And there is oh, now people God. that love Brown Bag, but they live on Mango Street. So unfuck you, okay? <laughs> <laughs> unfuck you. Just fuck that house that's on Mango Street. And I got drunk. They, they, Hard work they, and dedication. Shot, I still have more. Like you told me to be your cop. <laughs> <laughs> I know. As she gets drunk and can't pronounce words that she already can't pronounce. Well, it doesn't happen when just when she's drunk. <laughs> I have food in my mouth. She's closer Ew. to sober than drunk, dog. Yeah. <laughs> what are we naming this episode? Oh. <laughs> What's on your Thanksgiving playlist? Oh, um, that's a good one. Um, Country Road. How does country that go? Road. Old, old Country Road. Take me on. I've never heard that Why? in my old life. Town. Dude, by John Denver? Old Town Why? Road. Definitely. Play. Carol. Why? I belong. <laughs> Who broke your heart, dick? Just me and you. <laughs> Vic, Vic, keep drinking, Vic. No. I'll take one more shot. I'm in the country. Shout out to me and that out. You feel Let's me? take one more shot. Look, I still have a little bit of my cup. Come on. I ain't gonna lie though. Um, mm -mm. Usually, I ain't gonna like, hold up. I like when do not ain't gonna lie. Because <laughs> the usually, truth comes out. And Thanksgiving, and Thanksgiving, me and my homies, uh, for Thanksgiving, me and my homies usually go through like oldies that we all know. So, like, You by Chris Brown comes on. That's not old. Oh, yo, yo. <laughs> That's old for me. What the fuck? Sorry, 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 sorry. Oh, Dog. No. Is there a punch oh. sound effect? I was like 16. He's talking about yeah. Jordans on, on a you Saturday. You know the oldies? Like, Dr. Old Dre, 2001. <laughs> you like Jordans on a Saturday. How old was I when fucking uh, that came out? You or yo, whatever. Yo. You or yo. Those are two different They're songs. They're two different songs. All right, fuck it. Excuse me, miss. When did that come out? Oh, that was like 2006, so, I don't know. Six, Eight. Five. I mean, you were eight years old. I was, I was, I was 2005. Are I was like, five, dog. All these okay, are like, I'm eight your eight. puppy. <laughs> yeah, those are all these. Art LeBeau did not play yeah. Chris Brown. But, High five. But, but me See, and all my homies. You're doing bestie activities. Okay, I like okay, it. Okay, okay, oh, okay. Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> okay, but if we're being valid, I'm just old for me and my friends. Very yeah. frequent for you guys as, as teens. You know, I'm proud that you guys were there when you, you guys promoted the I'm song. Proud. On 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 hot wire, whatever you guys have. Hot wire. Lime wire. Lime wire. <laughs> hot wire. This was that hot wire. Whatever. But me and my homies, <laughs> we had it on an iPad. You know, I'm, I'm sorry. Oh my. You guys got anxiety God. while using YouTube back in the day. I don't think to do with we me. uploaded the first YouTube videos. Yeah, you guys record. came from us. You guys came out of our nutsack. So shut the Facts. fuck up. But I'm just saying, like. Me and my mom usually would play older I was on songs. YouTube when it was just cat videos and the uh, annoying that orange. Part. And you kick my dog? Oh, yeah. You, you yeah. kick my dog? <laughs> you come over to my house and you kick my dog? Or you go to the page and you do, like, voices? And then you just prank call people. Oh, the soundboards. Soundboards. E-bombs oh, world. Man. You guys prank call people? Fucking yeah, old ass fools. Yeah. You never prank called anybody? Fuck no. Hey, have you been, ever been on the party line? Ah, my Talk to homies me. were on the party line getting horny. And then, they'll, and then they'll lock something in and just leave. The party me. line was the first brown bag. <laughs> no, but look, fuck it, me and my homies usually bump like older music. Yeah. So we'll go with some like, <laughs> we'll go with some like Chris Brown, some Wonder Why, You're My Wonder Why. We'll go with some Hey There Delilah, Blink 182. Those are not old school. Hey There Delilah. <laughs> hey there, Delilah's pretty old. Um, um, we're old. Um, if you know Hey There Delilah, you're old way. Hey we are mid episode. Hey there, hey there. Um, I'm on I'm mind. on Instagram right now. <laughs> Say hi to Instagram. But we're recording. Stop. <laughs> I don't know what what do you guys usually bump? For when what? For Thanksgiving, like yeah, they're already drunk. Playlist comes on, everybody already ate. It's time to get drunk. Everybody shoots come on. No hay que llorar. Que la vida es un carnaval. cantando. Oh, you know it too, you little fucking bitch. You better not play. I don't know that shit. You know Celia Cruz. Uncultured. 
Ooh, Angie. You dress like you've been married for 20 years. Hit it with the blicky. Hell, how what, long? What is you and your family, Bum Celia Dick? Cruz. Um, usually Ralphie like, the plug? No, I wish. <laughs> 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 Big Swift playlist comes out. Fix. No, Big you guys. Swift come I have to play music. <laughs> I'm just playing on my artist. I just. <laughs> What comes out, Ralphie, 22 G Yeah. He's all, like, of, all of Vic's 2022 hottest MCs. <laughs> <laughs> I can't play the real music I like, so I have to play like neutral shit. Like, like I'll his? play like Bruno Mars, like wow. uh, oh, that's so oh. Anderson Pack. Yeah, grenade, I'll, grenade. And your family is not your, grenade. Your I'll dad, play like Silk Sonic. You your feel dad me? does not listen to Anderson <laughs> Pack. Forget the fuck out of no, here. No, I'll try big. to get him into it, but all he wants to play is fucking Pedro Infante all day. Shout out to your dad. Um oh, man. <laughs> oh no, stepmom, you're stuck in the dryer. <laughs> I hope you're getting drunk while listening to us. Otherwise, we probably look uh. so obnoxious. Who's more drunk? Who is the most? I took more a fat strength? ass shot. I took a fat ass shot. I'm burning out, wait, you guys. Wait, wait, just look at me. All three of you guys, look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Luna, tú también. Oh, you're talking about you're drunk. <laughs> look at me, and I'll tell you for your. Face. You guys heard me? Please, guys, tell me. Angie wants you to look at her. Look at me, dude. Look big, at me, look at me. Oh, it's do you know them big and then little. What? That's your the more head. drunk. My penis. This is Luria, you guys. Damn. Damn. Who Have you ever, okay, I know you've never done it. No, no, I know I've never, you've never done no, it. I'm so scared of that. No, I know you've never done it, but... Hell no. Wait, 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 wait. But has somebody hurt you, like a guy hurt you bad enough that you, like, thought about it really quick? Never. But then you're like, no. What is happening? Even the last fucking Prius Papi, I would... No. No? That's good. You're good. No. No. I don't even know how to do Don't put that filter on me. <laughs> Man, nobody's answering today. <laughs> no, don't put it on me. Oh, Jose fucking... Jose just said there's only 30 salvageable minutes of this podcast. <laughs> he said we were recording for two hours and then we can only air 30 minutes of it. <laughs> what are we going to do for Thanksgiving? Is this is what we're doing for Friendsgiving? <laughs> You're so horny? <laughs> this has been episode 72, you guys. 72. Make sure you guys press the link in our bio. You guys. Go buy tickets Wait, for the Novo. We like. can't be done. We have so much food. Angie, shut up. You haven't even tried Callie's food. I did. Wait. Me and Max. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take a bag home. We're in the middle home. of recording. <laughs> well, why did Callie bring it like there were kilos? We're in the middle of recording. <laughs> <laughs> we're in the middle of recording brown bag. Oh, All right, we're done. All right, Turn episode the seventy-two. Say buy bye, some tickets for brown the live show. The Novo. Get your tickets. They're about to for sell out. <laughs> Angie and Letty had the worst idea to get drunk together. Oh, yeah, the Novo, thanks. downtown LA. We'll see you guys the December Novo. 23rd. Press the link. Be there or be square. But Bring your bitch square, or your side okay, bitch. Bow. No okay. lanes allowed. Are we ending the podcast? Get that yeah, meet and greet. Apparently. Bye. I love you guys so much. Uh,